well not change the narrative but explain the narrative that I feel like it was, it was pushed towards the Tongani badge name. So I'm just saying to speak my truth needs to be confronted, the Twitter fingers kind of thing. You can talk about that. Yay guys, my people, I bring to you the very interesting update we have all been waiting for. Yes, the BB Niger reunion introduction. Yes, it is what they did today. But before I continue this update, you are welcome to my channel. Please do not forget to hit the red subscribe button below and turn on your notification bell. And comment your opinion on what you feel about this video. So now... This show just started with Abuka walking out majestically, introducing himself as the host. Of course, you know how he does that. So, after that, they now started introducing all the housemates. Guess the housemates they started with. No, you guess. Drop it on the comment section, guys. So, but I'm going to be giving you the breakdown of everything that happened in today's show. Okay? But the most things that happened were just introduction. Though one person wasn't there. Yes, Erica wasn't there. They said Erica will be joining the show while the reunion is still on. So, but the moment uh, they first of all introduced this set of persons, we have uh, Bright O, Katrina, Eric, and uh, Dorothy. So, these four persons were introduced first. I mean, the first um first four persons that entered the studio with Ebuka. do you understand now after this uh after mentioning them generally they started introducing them one by one how did they do this they mentioned let's say let's for instance they called bright o first they called bright o she said after the bb niger show bright o has done well for himself in still travels around the world you know bright o likes to love to travel so much so is and the show didn't stop him from uh, practicing what he studied that he has been doing well for himself so after that they also mentioned dorothy um you know dorothy ottt she has been doing well for herself too she <clears throat> she's brand ambassador to so many brands we know that and uh, she has a uh, she has um, an online company. She has a. Uh, she has so many things she's doing for herself that she's just into money, business, and money. And she has been cashing out lately, according to the introduction. So we have uh, Eric. Eric has been doing well in terms of his gym. Yes, he loves his gym so much, and he has been. He has developed much, much time more than the way. Yeah, it was before the house and he has been into business too and the brand ambassador of course you know most of the housemates are brand ambassador to one company or, on, or another so now we have uh, katrina the ceo katrina premium line of course you know she's into business and according to the story katrina has started her life or into yes she has started her business since she was 16 because i'm very very sure that this particular um show or the way they introduced this housemate they're the ones that wrote it down like that i'm very very sure yes because if you see how official the introduction is i don't think biggie would want to even introduce uh, introduce them like that though it is uh, it, it is a credit to them because right now if you are doing any business they mention it while uh, on the show you're got you're going to get customers yes it is advert it is pure advert okay fine um now they have said that katrina owned this uh, premium line business yes she has been pushing her fashion line worldwide after the show even as much as she did not spend much time while in the house that she, that uh, she's still she's still doing very well cashing her out according to the introduction katrina is really cashing out big time not minding she just spent two weeks only in the house so guys listen up after that ebuka called them inside the studio and they asked them if they if they have anyone they are missing so much that they have not seen for a long time um they said um nobody but but first of all he asked um eric if he has seen lilo for some time now <laughs> eric, eric laughed and um 
get him to laugh Ebuka also laughed yes because it's really a funny question because he did not even allow the show to start properly he's already trying to bring out a a buzz buzz this side so and after they laughed about that um they introduced um some set of persons gays the persons guys kid wire lecon and um you know these two persons are great individuals right kid wire work at the first when they called kid wire first they said kid wire is is just <laughs> They didn't mention any business but finally they said his business has been doing well they didn't actually mention any business in particular for kid wire so i can't mention anyone for you and uh they showed him enjoying his life because this actually this introduction came with kind of a documentary so they were showing some things they did or they have done before the reunion show so i think they submitted it to the to biggie before the show i think but i i think i love that yes I love that as much as they did only introduction today i i i must confess that the 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 introduction was tight mm -hmm. they documented it so much so very well that uh you 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 love to watch yes that is how the show is and um now they um hey, sorry if you can still brought them into the studio and asked them how the life has been and um after that of course uh, yes i didn't i didn't tell you about lecon lecon wow when he was introducing lecon lecon the special advisor to ogo state governor in, uh, an artist he's doing well in this too that he didn't he didn't just he didn't just uh just sing oil in the house that is singing has brought him big name yes he's not just a winner of big Niger. he has he has made more things come to pass for him or yes for himself yes is how i can put it because lecon has really achieved yes he has tried his best he's not just the winner of bb niger as okay look at the time of uh, this guy um the time all of this guy again i've forgotten this guy that won't be in niger with uh with uh toby no yes i can say leko is doing well more than efe thank you leko is also doing well more than a uh, miracle yes and uh, he's doing well for himself yes his music dropping steady is a good one he's not just artist with mouth he's doing it and we are saying it so now after the introduction elbuka asks them if there was anyone that they have missed so much they have not seen they said no one that uh, everybody he said nobody and he asked them about life if kidwaya said he thank god that he's uh he's at peace with himself he's uh he's relaxed so and i asked lecon how is it being a winner lecon said anyways he just thank god that he's living he didn't say any other thing you know that guy is wise i love him for that that he thank god he is living wow that is the most important thing for anyone once you're alive my dear you need to always thank god that you are alive that's all so that was what he answered uh, ebuka and now after that ebuka introduced some set of persons and uh, they are lucy yes lucy we know is ceo luciana grill She's doing well for herself as the CEO and that dream to make or to launch her Luciana Grill actually came past, came to pass after the BB Niger show. Good one for her. Then we have Lilo. Um, Lilo, we know, owns a restaurant. Yes, where she sells food store, uh, sorry, she sells food and drinks. So, which she launched a few months ago. And, uh, Ebuka then uh, asked them the same question like have you missed anyone when they introduced the two of them inside to meet with others they all hailed themselves as usual they were so happy to meet with themselves and uh, they asked uh, Lilo Katrina as uh, new person that met that just came in to the studio who have you missed 
and uh, they are sad Lilo said that uh, is um, I think Katrina also that yes that she has not seen Katrina for a long time like one year now so it's just that and um, okay sorry that she last saw Katrina last year that was what she said and uh, you know one thing the introduction kept on going and um, Ebuka brought in um, Ebuka brought in uh, this set of persons they are um, we have uh, Nengi Nio Ozo and Praise wow you see eh? what I don't really understand is the way people bring down their age but all the same I don't want to say anything about that um now at the introduction the first four called Nengi after Nengi Nio after Nio Ozo after Ozo praise and uh, you know that Nengi doing well for herself her shoe brand selling well and brand ambassador to so many brands and uh, she has been traveling from one country to another country recently so uh, we would just say she's doing generally well for herself and um, we have new new they didn't really tag any business to new they only said new is a model and the brand ambassador so which means new currently do not have a business or a known business that we can say is his so we don't know that yet uh we have also they said also has really built his dream and uh let's say his dream has come true because right now he's not just a lover of football he is a he, he is a manager to one of the top football um football uh schools in africa so you see his dream is is really really coming true and um which his dream also is to coach younger people in football you know uh, also was very good while in the house when it comes to sports he was very very good you know that guys and um his dream coming true when it comes to football he is you know he is it he's airing this uh, football show too on uh, tv so you see also he's very good and um he's a gentle guy i must confess he is so happy that his dreams are coming true and uh, you know how you know what it is when you love something or you love someone and the person is doing well or that particular thing is doing well and you love that thing so much you know how you know how that thing is or you're doing well in it when you know when you love the thing just you understand what i mean and you are feeding from the same thing that you love so much you see guys that is what is happening in most of these housemates life right now so we have praise praise no business was also attached to praise currently and uh and he said that praise love his gym he has been doing his gym exercise that he has grown way way big in his dancing uh, activities and uh his uh us his gym has has kept him going and he's into business at the moment so you see they did not mention any particular business when it comes to um um praise yes guys so the introduction kept on going guys and uh, they brought in um sorry guys when they asked um when they asked them to walk in yes when they walked in inside the studio you know new now new like to make noise sorry but i feel new is so lousy so immediately he started making that his usual noise again and um I, I me i was already telling the person i was watching the the, the reunion with say like, this guy this guy can't just talk this guy this guy oh my god this guy has not just talked this is character so wow to me he would just he, he to me he to me he's lousy to an extent but to himself i feel he's trying to be happy yes he's trying to be happy but he should always mind it yes so because i was even telling him see guy this is not be the no be the main show be this you just come reunion no <laughs> so guys uh um the other ones they just come they ask them about life they say life is good yes the asked new first new talked plenty 
so many things and um, they asked mm, also also said he's good she thank god for his life and uh, asked nengi nengi he just said nengi said she's grateful she's thankful and the uh, life is moving on well and uh, asked praise how his life praise also said that he thank god he is alive and everything is moving on fine and uh, that is what matters you understand Ebuka asked how um how long they have seen themselves they said <laughs> they said um um some said not quite long some said is it was it has been a long time and um they also say who who do they really miss so much they said nobody yes though neo tried to call someone's name but later he said nobody and uh <laughs> so that was it and um the introduction kept on going and uh he, they introduced prince separately i don't know why i don't know why they introduced prince separately but that was prince introduction he walked in like a prince that he is and um after prince they introduced tochi after tochi to lani barge yes yeah when it comes to prince they didn't also call any business but they said he's doing well with his hairdressing uh business you know while in the house he was very good at doing or uh, fixing someone's hair so they said he's doing well and uh he loved what he's doing he's also a brand ambassador to so many brands yes and um they asked tochi tochi is a businessman real estate and uh though at the moment they didn't uh, they didn't call any business too but this is they said he's a businessman and uh you know uh when they mentioned the uh, talani badge talani badge is a vlogger yes you know of course you know talani by our youtube that where she 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 brings down or she she tells us her daily activities kind of and uh it's a good one for her then they introduced tricky tea sorry guys sorry guys sorry guys they introduced tricky tea tricky tea is a producer and it a right on yes they showed him where he was carrying his camera he was roaming around taking one or two shots and uh well, 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 they did a nice introduction guys i'm not true you know the introduction i i enjoyed it it's so catchy and so interesting to watch i enjoyed it guys then after the walk them into the studio because ask them the usual question if they miss anyone if they are happy they are here you know how is life after the reality show they said that everything has been so nice and uh tricky to say he's so grateful why um to learn about how is life he said them um, when he asked when she was asked how is life and why she's here she said that she, life is fine that she's just here to clear up uh, everything clear her mind you know state things right let people hear it and um when um when uh um when she, when uh, tricky t was asked he didn't actually say anything he said he's just fine happy to see everyone you know and that's all so now the introduction has not ended though remember there is still v and watoni yes they now introduce v and v was walking majestically wow like a queen that she is and she when she walked in and i mean i mean you know v after the vivi niger show she added hosts to her own uh, to her career which according to her she said she never knew that she could be a host wow you see why why they say what doing is what doing well remember people max v as a good host while she was inside house they were testing them in one or two hosting activities so you see it is good that you do whatever thing you're doing right because you never can tell who is going to see you or who is going to pick you up you never can tell where life is going to face you guys so now the introduction continues and um they still ask them how life is doing um you know what one is a vlogger and an author yes you know the show that she's on a uh, baby show which is still on and she said according to her she believed that the next episode of the next season is going to be more more interesting yes that baby talk show now she 
said she thank God for life when she when they were when they were asked how life is doing they said they thank God for life everything is moving on fine that um the what Tony said that we keep pushing yes that was the word she used and um V said everything has been perfectly fine and okay so now after that introduction that's when they walked into the studio don't forget this question was asked if you can ask them this question inside studio don't forget that guys so now when they asked um when uh, they asked uh, oh sorry when they, after the question they can ask said we have to um wait for the next person before this uh before adverts now played after the advert after the advert they came back and um it happened that the last person was introduced yes they said the next person will join us after the uh, sorry while in the reunion show that was what Ebuka said and you know the next person is erica so everyone is expecting the star girl to come into the show because i'm very very sure fans are already putting their ears and eyes up to know the season or the episode that she's going to walk in don't don't be scared star girl erica is still going to come into the show guys so and um after the advert they came in and they uh, they started uh, they started playing flashback things that happened during the re re the reality show yes the bb niger reality show and again they started playing all their crying moments everybody that has virtually cried though i'm telling you the only person i didn't see crying i think was um Tochi and uh, New. Yes, they didn't cry. But guys, everybody cried. Why in the house? Me, I didn't even take note of all those things. I ju They just compiled all the cry. Erika was a cry, cry baby. Hmm. Everybody. Almost everybody. Let me put it that way. Cried. So now, when they came back after the little flashback, they now asked them how or uh, what if they can go on with the show he said yes of course they can go on with the show i said okay going on with the show now they said do you, does anybody have what to say before we start this main business <laughs> you need to see how Ebuka was asking this because Ebuka can't know how to ask this question straight to say yes katrina said yes sorry tolani but said yes first yes yes that she's here Yes, Tulani Ba said first that she's here to sort out things, let the open mind be free and clear out, clear clear all the things in her mind and let people understand everything and move on with positive vibes because the housemates shouted positive vibes, positive vibes, positive vibes. So, but um it, it kind of asking everyone to be of uh, let's say good vibes you know new now always shouting positive vibes everywhere but this time around it wasn't only new that shouted it though so immediately they also asked uh, them tell her, and katrina also said that you know she stayed only two weeks that a lot of persons have negative uh, things to say about her that she you know that she has that she need to clear she used to use this reunion and clear everything clear and let people understand her that so many people have this negative mindset towards her that she need to clear it in this reunion so that was where it ended they said when they come next one that they are going to give us the letters boys boys that is knocking then they now started doing a um they now started showing us what will come up next so guys that's it and uh, please stay tuned to my channel guys because here now i believe you have a lot of questions to ask me to ask concerning this bb niger show so drop it on the comment section guys and just know that i'll be giving you the latest update upon updates that you want in this reunion show i also give you the update in uh, bb niger um bb niger season six that is coming up soon just know that here too you get the update in the voice nigeria the Nigerian I do guys just know that I am here to give you the latest updates that you need I still remain your humble self 
your humble servant, your humble every, every jolly toko, your musician. I love you guys. Stay tuned. Stay tuned. Please follow me on my social media handles at Jolly Choco. Stay tuned.